when it comes to trucks and SUVs, one major problem is the common rail injector. And if you are interested in this video, we will talk about it today. Today, we are going to talk about the common rail injector of a Sinner Truck Huwu 380. If you are new to my channel, please click that subscribe button and the notification bell so you won't miss our videos. And if you want to visit our Facebook page, it's facebook.com springject common rail. A customer calls telling us that the engine of his truck creates a knocking sound. So we make a schedule and proceed to visit the truck. When we view the truck, it makes a knocking sound. So we use our scanner to examine it, but no DTCs was found. I called the owner and inquired as how to this happened. He said that the fuel had been diluted with water, and he claims that the driver of the truck filled up the tank from the unknown gas station. I told the owner that we needed to remove the injector first to see if it was the source of the problem. He then gives his approval. We promptly tested the injector in our test bench and disassembled it to see whether any of the parts were worn out. However, it does not have high volume of back leaks. We informed the owner that it would need to be reconditioned. As you can see from the video, the interior of the injector was packed with rust and dirt as we disassembled it. After disassembling the injector, we place it on an ultrasonic tank to remove debris that the brass can't reach. After cleaning the injector, we replace the seal ring and a valve ball. As you can see, the rust and the debris on the injector were eliminated after cleaning it. Now we simply need to finish the assembly and test it on the test bench. It's now time to put the injector to the test. To claim that the injector has been reconditioned, we must readjust the delivery to pass on all of the tests. The VE, LL, TL, VL return, and the lead test. When all of the tests has been passed, it's time to install the injector and hope for the best that the ducking noise has been eliminated. We inspect the diesel that was drained from the tank as we install the injector. There is still dirt visible and it is not a good fuel. And now it's almost time for the installation to be completed. It's now time to look at the results. Before we proceed, we must listen to the knocking sound before the injector was reconditioned so that we can observe the results. And this is the outcome of reconditioning the injector. So, that's it for today. Hope you liked the video and if you liked it, Please click that subscribe button and the notification bell. And if you want to follow us on Facebook, 
It's facebook.com forward slash Springject Commonwealth. And always remember, to God be the honor and glory. Keep safe.